to I am Pinstar, and this is City Skyline Strategy and Tactics, episode 82. So, in our last episode, uh, we got ourselves uh, this little, uh, well, what would, would be industrial outcropping over here. Um, and uh, going to be planning our uh, first expansion here and in tapping into Simurara over here. Um, now, given the way the demand curves are situated right about now, I'm thinking that maybe our best course of action would probably be to uh, develop this southern bit of Simurara uh, commercially first, uh, then add in all this industrial stuff over here, then develop in the northern stuff, and then about that time, they're going to start screaming for lots of residentials, at which point all the rest of this is going to be residentials, including another double-double, or rather double-tree zone here, along with plenty of uh, outskirts and suburbs. So that is my plan. So let us put this plan into action, shall we? Um, the other thing I wanted to do is um, uh, plop a reward building down here for our commercial zones, because they probably want that. Uh, now let's see, what are you? No, no. Still don't have that. Still has not re yet registered that. Well, we'll keep checking in on it. Uh, what about you? Tax office. Well, we can throw down a tax office. We don't need it, but we can throw it down. Um, yeah, why not? We'll throw it. Well, we're not going to throw it down the middle. We need uh, we need room for the for the for the lines to go and all that. Um, well, actually, you know what we could do is we could throw it down in the middle and then have this skirt to the south. Um, so we'd probably uh, smush some of uh, some of our potential uh, our our potential uh, things here, but uh, if we can just skirt around the tax office, we'll still get a big boost to the zone here. So hey, why not? Well, it might tell me why not in that it might say that nope, you can't do that. That's too clever. But we'll try. Although these hills are going to make things a little bit dubious. Yeah, a little bit dubious. Oh, well, duh. Didn't start. Remember, they have tunnels now. Durr, hey. Can't believe I keep forgetting about tunnels. <laughs> All right, there. Glorious tax office. Right in the middle of what will be our commercial district. I'm sure they will appreciate it greatly. All right, uh, so let's see here. Uh, we also are going to need to start metro lining up our area, and we're also short on cash, so I think we're going to need to take up more of these loan things. Uh, let's just take the big one here. That way we're not farting around. No farting around here. Because we're going into expansion mode. Right then. Uh, all right, so we're definitely going to need a... All right, it's a little bit further walking distance from the uh, terminal than I normally place them, but they are close enough walking distance to the tax office so that anyone who wants to visit that uh, as a tourist, I don't know why you'd want to visit a tax office as a tourist, but some of these tourists can be a little silly. Um, yeah, so yeah. Uh, we're also going to want one by here. Um, right here would be pretty good, although... Uh, now we got bus coverage to get this area going for us. Uh, and I want these guys linked in. So we got that. I also want a uh, one by our industrial area to sort of help them out. And yeah, we'll get it uh, we'll get it by our uh, our uh, by this here. And since no one's developed there, no one's going to mind us building there. Lovely. All right. Um, I think I think I'm gonna just do a triangular, just a little, a circular, not a triangular, a circular. Well, it's kind of triangular. A circular uh, build with these three zones here. Um, yeah. Let's 
get you curve in here. Actually, I could uh, I could sort of incorporate the uh, the upper one of these here, like that, since that's going to be part of the part of the thing anyway. Might as well run it through here. Although I don't know if they're going to necessarily stop at that point, but eh, whatever's. What ifs? All right, we got so we got that line going. All right, so we're going to start here. We're going to go here. We are going to go here and then end here. Now, is there any reason I can think of for them to go the other direction? Not really. Not really, because the industrial zones are probably going to have workers going to them from elsewhere. And honestly, these the, the, the people getting on the metro lines are people going to be coming from the residential lines elsewhere. Because, I mean, none of these areas are residents, so we're not going to have any people coming through here. But we do want the uh, we do want the tourists who arrive at this train station to be able to go straight to here. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I think that's going to be our best bet. And then later on, when we get uh, residential zones over here, then they can start filtering in through all these different zones nicely. Okay. Um, oh yeah. Well, since I'm since I'm doing it, might as well build the one down here for uh, for this metro line, and then get ourselves a standard issue uh, uh, one two three one two. So new line, add stop, new line, add stop, finish the line. Wonderful. All right, so we've got that going for us. And yeah, let's let's focus on the commercial zone first. So we get our uh, get our niceties going here. And you know what, let's double up on these because these guys, especially down here, are going to get bordered by some industrial zones. So they're probably going to have a little bit of pollution drifting on over to them. So they're going to need a little bit more oomph to, uh, to maintain their levels. All right, so... And yeah, let's get our crosswalks going. These might be a little fun with all these hills flying around here. Although this southern area is not as bad. I wish these two would just auto-connect themselves. It's kind of the point. And one more. And then I think for um, completeness sakes we will have you wander on down here. And go over here so you can uh, hook up with the industrial zone section here. Um, and then obviously we're going to want some walkers to be able to get... Right, well, they're going to take the sidewalk here, so we can actually have this thing go, go airborne nice and early. And yeah, we'll just we'll just take out one little section here, and that will let everyone here be able to get over here. And this is really the destination to go, so we'll want them walking over in this direction anyway before they uh, transfer over. All right, let's get our zoning going. And yes, we are doing a full high density. Um, oh, I already zoned this stuff industrial, so I can do I can do the blanket spread here. Well, no, no. Uh, let's be a little bit more picky about where we zone. In fact, let's do this. We're going to zone into here. That way all you get electricity. You get electricity. I want you getting electricity. And then these guys are just sort of high water marks because these, these commercial zones are going to love being right here in the middle. Um, and then we need some form of electricity. Oh yeah, these guys are actually going to develop themselves to industrials because I already zoned them in the last episode. I'll leave them as such because we still have industrial demand left over. 
Um, but they all want utilities. Um, I did uh, water them up. So let's uh, let's extend the favor for at least the southern part of this zone. Vandabar. And now power. Power, power, power. Pow, pow, power wheels. Power wheels. Anyone remember the commercials? I do. Never had one as a kid. The, uh, like, the big drivable ones. Not, obviously, the... No, yeah, the big drivable ones were... I'm, I'm thinking of Matchbox cars. Alright, so, yeah, you guys can just leapfrogging through, uh, through here. Since this isn't zoned anyway, so don't mind them there. Hopefully this is close enough onto the blue that it actually counts. Although, yeah, it, yeah, it sit you there without uh, stomping on anything. All right, lovely. Uh, last but not least, I need my services. Uh, and by the looks of it, I might either have to take a uh, take a loan here or uh... there we go. One, two. Um, medic. And, uh, well, they want a cemetery. Uh, I'd love to put in a uh, cremator, but, uh, yeah. And we'll worry about death care later. Because I do want a cremator rather than a uh, cemetery here, because this is going to be kind of compact. All right, so let's unpause, get our speed going here. And see how these uh, uh, zones do. Now these guys are going to be whining about uh, power as well, but hopefully the, these areas develop and therefore spread the power to the industrial zones over here without too much of an issue. Uh, I am also curious to see what the traffic does, especially to my uh, one-up interchange here. Because uh, this thing's probably going to see a lot of traffic uh, as this whole region gets developed, and uh, if it's not uh, if it's not ready to handle some higher levels of traffic, it may be giving me problems. But in the same vein that I usually do, we will diagnose them on the fly as they crop up. Because um, you know why why overdiagnose something if uh, if it's not going to work for you. Or it's not going to be a problem, rather. Oh yeah, we got also uh, Prime Simarara with the proper policies. Uh, let's see here. We don't need recycling. We've got plenty. Of, we've got a dirty area nearby. Uh, we do want Parks and Rec. Uh, we don't need education use. At least not yet, anyway. Uh, probably once we do that. Recreational use? Absolutely. Uh, pet ban, smoking ban. Eh, we can do a smoking ban. Um, actually, why? Well... Yeah, we'll do it. We'll do it. And we don't need the smoke detectors because our, our our spammy uh, fire department placement's pretty good. Uh, we could raise the tax for higher density commercial. Actually, you know what? Let's do that. Because I need money. <laughs> Let's be honest here. I need the money. Uh, we are not high business, but we're not high uh, big business benefactor. We don't need the industrial space planning. So uh, yeah, we want money. Give us money. Give us lots of money. All right, uh, business is starting to crop up. That's good. Did I paint the whole zone? I did not. Well, they've got the uh, area over here uh, powered up, so we can paint this down here so we can hopefully walk the power down here um yeah you guys on this side of the road be uh you guys get to be um commercial because i'm not going to be extending uh industrial like further this way because we don't want to get that into the residential area but we'll worry about zoning them as soon as we walk power where we want it. And actually, just, uh, well, might as well, might as well do this while I'm waiting for the other zone to cook, since I know this is going to be necessary. Yikes! What in the world is this monstrosity here? That is one steep slope. Yikes! What'd you do there, Millie? No, 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 I don't want... 
You can make tunnel. You can make tunnels. Uh, t tunnel paths. That's actually kind of cool. But that's not what we want right now. There, that's better. All right. Make sure you guys are hooked up. Hooked up. Good. At least the Highlands are uh, cooperating with us, mostly. Graphical anomalies aside. Um, now, I do want to put a port here, um, because this is going to be a touristy, commercially area here. Uh, port is always worth it, because it's pretty far away from our next port. Well, actually, it's not that far away. But in the grand scheme of things, if you look at the transportation networks, it is. Because uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna plug this highway directly into here. I'm okay with it filtering through here and coming back and around like that. Uh, otherwise, the, the 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 waterways are just gonna get just too cluttered, in my opinion, too cluttered. All right, let's walk our uh, commercial zones northwards here. Wow, look at that! Look at that! Medium demand for industries or offices, but the industries over here aren't developing. So that makes me think people are pining for more office space. Hmm, I didn't know they were uh, that, that hungry for it. And they're also pining for some seawalls. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Well, here. This was the former uh, incinerator site, so why don't you uh, office space that up? Um, I guess what I could do is do some more offices over here. I mean, I got this little nub over here. Might as well. Might as well. Let's, yeah, let's plug you in. Let's plug you in over here. Yeah, we'll start with that. We'll fill in the next one once all the rest of these offices get filled in. Um, but yeah, office uh, office zones. Uh, we just want the stuff that would naturally be not part of uh, of our uh, Weeping Willow zone to be offices. Let's check utilities. Yeah, you guys need the water. That's fine. Um, and let me check other services. Uh, healthcare's not bad, actually. Um, not bad, not bad. Alright, so you guys will be sort of the, not the, 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 the less prime office space. Well, now look at this. I'm surprised that they are not, alright, well that, uh, they left it the chance to develop the, uh, the former incinerator spot. But they are not uh, jumping at the chances to uh, get this uh, office location over here. Let me just make sure that this isn't like a weird one way when it really shouldn't be a weird one way. No, that that looks that looks pretty normal to me, which is fine. Yeah, just this the little a little nook of offices. Heck, I might even extend uh, extend the zone over here. Uh oh. Corpse is waiting to be picked up, eh? What's our uh, what's our death care coverage around here like? Well, coverage is good. Capacity might not 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 be. And we still gotta get death care coverage to these commercial zones, so let's throw this down. Maybe they can lend a hearse or two to the issue. But yeah. Well, maybe these industrial zones will start developing once, uh, um, uh, once they get, uh, once they, um, power gets spread over here naturally by the development of this building. Because it, yeah, if, 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 if this was literally all offices, this, this whole line would be developing, like, really quickly. I mean, it's starting to tap into it. So there is some office demand built up there. But uh, yeah, these guys should be uh, these guys should be hitting their stride in, in a little bit here. Let me check the the actual power. No, the power spread is not over here. 
So we actually need a building to spread its way over here before an industrial zone is really willing to take up, take up residence, if you will. Uh, I am a patient man. I can wait for that. I'll uh, I'll hold off on my spread of commercial zones elsewhere. Uh, let me see. Yeah, I already I already did Ouroboros in terms of uh, of getting it going here. Now this area is starting to get kind of a little thick with trucks. Um, so I may need to optimize this area uh, in the near future. Heck, I could probably have uh, one just go right directly into the uh, truck lane here. Part of me is dreading that this this strip right here in the middle is going to need to become a five lane to handle the the, the raw traffic that's going to be going on it. Uh, but that's not going to be fun because we're going to have to move slash demolish our two train stations and therefore just about everything else. So we'll 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 keep an eye on it and see if we uh, if we need to do that or if we can get away with. Aha! Okay, so you should be spreading um, spreading power uh, momentarily here to our industrial zone friends. Yes, yes, good. Oh, they see now it's starting to bleed dry. So maybe that was all offices. Yeah, because we got a little office park just sprung right up over here. Um, yeah. Yeah, you guys are fine, as is. Maybe get a bus line to you. We, you guys need a bus line. Because you're not, you're not a big enough presence to warrant uh, uh, anything super fancy. But a bus line would probably do you well. So we'll throw a bus line down here. Um, what kind of path does that take you? That's not too bad. We uh, have you stop in front of uh, in front of here. Now, what kind of path does it take you? If you go here. It's going to go you know, somewhat more roundabout path, but that's okay. We'll take it. Um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything more I want to do with this particular bus path. Could have it stop over here. Yeah, why not? And then have you uh, finish up over here. There. Because these guys could probably use a little bus love. And then, uh, just for consistency's sake um, and continuity's sake, get ourselves a uh, yeah, built on water. <laughs> well, sorry, guys. That's better. Well, slightly better. I don't like that this is taking up two two tiles. Let me uh, let me let me try and fix. Um. Yeah, cannot build on water, cannot build on water. There! The water receded just long enough for people to technically be able to walk there. So that'll probably be underwater for a while. Also, let me try something. Someone was saying try adding roads. Uh, to guard against the water, although I can't when the water is already there. So we'll have to wait. Once I unlock that building, I may ultimately just demolish this um, and uh, just call it a day. Or what I might do is um, put it down, uh, put another one down there where it's a little bit less cumbersome and possibly a bit more effective too. All right. So, all right. Yes, we are doing. We are finally getting some industrial activity over here. That is good. Um, all right. Our office space is growing nicely. I am gonna have to break this power line here. Uh, so let me pause to make sure uh, the region does not go south. Because I do want to sort of maximize this little area here. Nope. 
And I also need the tree line one anyway. I need, ah, uh, that's annoying. I just need one more tile. All right, let's try this. That's more like it. There we go. Perfect. All right, you guys get to be more office, more office, more office. And since we've got a sort of a native bus stop over here, uh, we'll get ourselves a little pathway so that the back half of you guys can take a meander over here quite easily. Beautiful. All right, uh, that's good for me. Uh, let's, uh, do we need a hook? Well, hmm. We, uh, we plunk you over here. Well, that technically works. That technically works, and it should provide the power to, to the, yeah, to the office zones over here, so that should uh, work nicely, actually. Uh, do I have to rezone? No, I don't have to rezone. I think it's just a matter of the office demand recovering. All right, people, uh, people liking that, uh, that tax office. Can't imagine why. All right. Well, I think this is a good stopping point. So in our next episode, we continue to expand our operations um, to, uh, to to develop the region. And look at that. We are just finally getting our first peak of residential demand after many, many, many hours. Well, not I wouldn't say hours, but many, many minutes in game, which is hours uh, in the grand scheme of things. Um, so we're going to see how much uh, how much more we can we can push this uh, industrial office commercial only development before the city just starts running out of people to staff everything. Uh, so stay tuned. It should be a fun one. So uh, until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya.